Hello guys, welcome to my new video. Today we're gonna make some input events, uh, some physics and mostly other things. For now, uh, let's just run our game and we can remember what we did in the last lesson. Start and yeah, the pipes are broken. As I said, I will fix, we will fix this later. But for now, we need to make the collision events when we input uh, the space. The bird must jump and we should add the gravity to this bird. Let's just uh, go to the bird class and I show you t uh, another uh, uh, different notes uh, for PD thing. Let's just search for body and as you can see the static body 2D, the character body 2D and rigid body 2D. Static body as you can see, the useful for floors and walls, character body, which will be used this now, and the rigid body 2D. The rigid body 2D is very complex, so I won't use this. Uh, the character body seems more beginner friendly, so let's just move the, move with the character body 2D. Read, and uh, it gives a warning, as you can see. It actually wants a collision shape to the as a child, so let's just give it what he wants. Uh, search for collision shape 2D, but now the collision shape 2D gives an error. It, now it wants a shape, so it's actually pretty easy. Just click on the collision shape 2D, uh, nav navigate to the right panel. As you can see, the shape and empty. Click on the empty, select your uh, shape for example circle rectangle capsule I'm going with the uh, circle now let's make this bigger now let's run our game again uh, literally not happen because we should set this character about to the as our child uh, sorry sir as our main root what we can do that is actually this is pretty easy to just right click my as you can see, the make sign root, and now we have our character body 2D as our uh, main. So let's just run our game again. As you can see, the actually the texture is moving. The node is not not moving. So because this is the uh, because of the bird script, as you can see, we were uh, changing the position in this here. Now we should detach this script from the bird node because we don't need the bird node anymore. So let's just click on the character body 2D, uh, click on the name, attach a node script, uh, navigate to your bird script, open, load. Now we load the script to the character body 2D to our root node. But we should change the extent node 2D because our main node is character body 2D, not node 2D. So let's just character body 2D and let's just comment this line. Run our game. Now everything is fine. Now let's just define some variables uh, like for gravity to equal uh, 5. Um, let's just add gravity to this bird. All we can do that is let's create a var uh, with maybe um, what we should name it. And j for now, just vector velocity. For now, Still vector two. Okay, okay. Now we should uh, let's just set the vector velocity x equals speed uh, with delta in the a position we should set the vector velocity at a plus gravity with delta and we should wish to move and collide and give the vector velocity. Why we wish this function, I will tell you later. But for now, just know that this will move the 
entire node. Now let's run our game. And the gravity had the and the bird is flying. But uh, let's just decrease the gravity for now and increase the speed. Okay. Okay, now this must be fine. And uh, as you can see, the camera is following the bird even when the bird falling to the ground. How we can fix that? Let's just go to our play screen. Let's come here. Instead of the setting the global position, we will just set the X position. Uh, and let's just do this. Now our camera must... Oh, yeah, yeah. For this, we should edit the camera. Where is it? Uh, maybe you can remember we were setting drug center and fixed top this. We need to check check this fixed top list so it must be fine now let's check it and yeah but now now uh, it is actually not good as uh, it is more like anyway let's just fix this how we can do that is let's just make the maybe like this Good actually as well. Uh, let's just make this uh, maybe. Oh, sorry. Okay, now it must be fine. Uh, now what we will do is we should set the input maybe. Okay. Click on the project, go to the project settings, and click on the input map. As you can see, add navig action. Click on here, make this jump, and click on the add. Now we added our jump uh, action. Now click on this add event, and click on the space. As you can see. Now click on the walk button. Now. We set for uh, space, and when we click on the space, we will set the event handle to do here to play screen. Uh, I don't want to handle the input in the bird function. Instead, I sh I want to handle this from here. So, how we can handle it? Well, we can push the input uh, uh, function as you can see. Now, uh, this input function works when a specific event is working. For example, when we click on the space or something. So, for now, if input that is action just pressed, as you can see, this or action is here, jump. The other actions are put in action, so we don't need it. Just click on the jump and let's print something. For example, where are fly? For example, now, let's run our game. We're gonna start. Press the space, and as you can see, we are playing the pop up see in the old blocks. So let's come the bird again. Now let's set our jump function. The jump function. Function jump. Whenever we click on the space. I want to set the vector velocity A as, uh, for example, mm, let's just vector velocity that A equals. We should set another uh, variable here, for example, for jump uh, jump uh, equals A B ten. No, jump. Oh, sorry, jump. Are we done? Not yet. We should come here to function input. Uh, instead of printing, we are playing. Let's just uh, make this bird dot jump. Okay, now we must be done. Click on the run button. Click on start. 
press the start but this but this literally pushed the bird to the ground but we can fix that we should set the jump and this like this now let's turn our game click on the jump but now oh we should set the uh, we should set the gravity we should increase the gravity let's make this 10 okay 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 now actually this is better somehow anyway guys maybe today it is enough uh, so <laughs> I don't know why but it is a pleasure uh, before finishing let me clear the clear thing guys I'm not really studying the videos or something or production or literally nothing my main goal is just teaching you guys something different things and literally I don't really care the like and sub subscribe but if you really like the video I would would you like to see you're liking this video or something anyway uh, in other video we will set the collisions and we will set the random pipes in the map maybe that's all for now okay have a nice day and see you in the other video goodbye